if you are fasting during Ramadan is, I don't know, maybe a week into it. I don't know how many days I've been fasting. But it's about a week into it. And for some, it becomes difficult around this time because it's getting redundant. It's getting difficult because it's happening every day. For some. For me, that's the truth. First day, first two days, first three days. I could do it. It's difficult because my body is adjusting, but I'm fresh, so I can do it. And then a week into it, it starts getting difficult because I got a long way. And I start focusing on, man, what time is the fast breaking meal? What? I gotta wake up again that early? And I wake up early anyway. And I would technically wake up before the dawn prayer, but I wouldn't start making dawn prayer meals or pre dawn prayer meals. Actually, they're just called pre dawn meals. There's an Arabic word for it, but I don't want to run people off and make people think, hey, that religion is just for Arabs. No. God is the God of all people. Even if you don't believe in God, God is still your God. So, what I start to do around this time and I thought about this last night. It was getting difficult. And I kept on asking my daughter, what time is it? I was watching TV. <laughs> she told me, 9.40. I'm like, 9.40? No, she said 9.20. I'm like, 9.20? I miss breaking my fast. I can eat. Say, like, oh no, 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 no. I looked at the clock. The clock. Wrong. I'm like, really? <laughs> so she got my hopes up. But my point is, I'm starting to focus on how I am fasting. And last night I started thinking, okay, this is where I start to make it difficult. Because I'm focusing on how and what I'm doing instead of why I am fasting. And then this morning, I woke up, drank my coffee, made the pre-dawn meals for me and my two daughters who are fasting with me. And got ready pray and after I prayed I realized okay you need to start focusing on why you are fasting and stop focusing on how you are fasting as in what time is it as in let me find out when Ramadan ends I don't even know what date Ramadan ends now, of course, some say, well, no one knows. That's a whole nother video. But, so, I just want to make this video to say, for me, I'm going to start to focus on why I am fasting instead of how I am fasting. And maybe that could help someone who is fasting 
who is getting to that difficult part where they start to focus on the time of when they're going to eat and that becomes the focus or you're thinking about man what am I going to eat when I break my fast and all those things are fine to do but when that becomes your focus in my opinion it makes things harder so for me for example when I started to think why am I fasting and I started this last night I just started thinking about this last night and I get to this point a lot of times during Ramadan but um, last night I started thinking that and then when I did the night prayer I just focused on why and I felt how I'm connected to God I was experiencing God my prayer was more powerful in the sense that the connection between me and God was uncovered there's already a connection there but I cover it up everyone is already connected to God according to Islamic theology just some people have it covered up so this morning I did the same thing when I did my dawn prayer I felt this feeling of, I guess, taqwa. I felt it. I felt a connection. I felt God within, Allah within. And I don't mean Allah's inside my body. I mean, in that general statement, it means my connection to God is felt. And throughout the day, I'm going to focus on why I am fasting. Why am I fasting? And I have my why, and actually my whys. One main why for me is to remove all the coverings of that connection with God. And one of those coverings is looking at the time of when is the fast over. Remove that. Just focus on why I am fasting, which is to feel the pure connection between me and God. And others may have their whys that may differ, and they may have different coverings that cover up that connection they have with God. So, that's all I wanted to share. So I'll sum it up. Connect to why you are fasting and not to how you are fasting. Peace and love.